A guy named Vsync just dropped a new Bacchus mod plugin to get workshop maps faster on Epic Games, and today I'm gonna show you how. Oh, and by the way, this method is honestly better than the Steam workshop, so if you're watching on Steam, you probably should set this up too, because it will literally only take two minutes. Okay, first thing you're gonna wanna do is go to the Bacchus Mod website for this plugin. So if you don't, make sure you have Bacchus Mod installed, but then I'll have this plugin linked in the description below. Once you get to the website, simply hit install with Bacchus Mod at the top here, and the plugin will be automatically loaded into Bacchus Mod on your PC. Now for the critical step. Before you open up Rocket League, open Bacchus Mod first, click File, and select Open Bacchus Mod Folder. This is going to send you to the Bacchus Mod Folder on your PC, where you'll need to right-click and create a new folder to actually store the workshop maps you're going to download here in just a second. By the way, name doesn't matter here, but I suggest just right-clicking and creating a folder called Workshop Maps, or whatever you want to call it. Once you do that though, open up your newly made folder, scroll up to click this little folder icon here on Windows, and hit Control c to copy the folder pathing. We're going to need this in a second. Now, you're ready to switch back over to Rocket League. Once you've booted up Rocket, hit F2 to open the Bacchus Mod Plugin Manager, scroll down to get Workshop Map Loader, and open the plugin here. Then, once you're at the main menu, we're gonna need that file directory you copied earlier. Paste whatever you controlled seed into this search bar here, but then make sure you add a forward slash at the end. If you don't add a forward slash, for whatever reason, the plugin manager won't recognize any of the workshop maps you save, and I had this issue for the longest time without knowing why. So make sure you add a forward slash at the end of your file pathing. Hit save, and we're almost done. From here, you can navigate over to the Steam Workshop or the RocketLeagueMaps.us website where you'll be able to search up whatever workshop maps you want to play. You can search up anything here. For sake of example, I'll use Rings 3, but regardless of what you're using, once you've got your map, all you have to do is simply hit download, wait a second for the plugin to boot, and then tab back into Rocket League. Finally, reopen the homepage, hit refresh, and you should see your new workshop map sitting there. Supposedly, multiplayer is on the way soon, but for now, you can hit play solo, and you should be loaded straight into your new workshop map. If you want to add more maps, you can go back to the store in the plugin, and it's as easy as hitting download, but once you know that, you can now get any workshop map you want on Steam and Epic Games. That was fast, so I highly recommend rewatching this. And hey, I know 75% of my viewers watching right now are not subbed to the channel, so if you like this content, subscribe for more free Rocket League tips. Or if you want to go above and beyond, I'm still recruiting for season six of my coaching program, but 50% of the tickets have already sold out. So if you're 18 plus years old, you can DM me the keyword EPIC on Discord ASAP to get coaching with me and my team. As always though, thanks for watching.